live from Peabody Place in downtown Memphis. This is News Channel 3, live at 9, with Alex Coleman and Mary Beth Conley. Oh, there it is. Do you see folks uh, kind of standing out there already? Not to say that they're lining up now, but <laughs> that will be one of the focal points. This time tomorrow morning, Mary Beth, when hopefully hundreds of Memphians and Mid-Southerners will say, this is the day. Uh, we're going to lose a little fat, lose I'm a little of the I'm going to make tummy. the commitment. Here's what we have going on this morning on News Channel 3 Live at 9. For one thing, we'll talk to civil rights pioneer Dr. Benjamin Hooks about his life and his brand new book, The March for Civil Rights, The Benjamin Hooks Story. We also have the fitness director from Prevention Magazine here in Peabody Place, and she's going to show us some stretches we can all do before this healthy Memphis kickoff walk. And Mary Beth will also talk about a new twist on an old device, the heating pad. We have one of the men behind this new device this morning right here on News Channel 3 Live at Night. So after your walk and you're feeling a little pain there, <laughs> this might help out tremendously. Welcome back to News Channel 3 Live at 9. This morning we're introducing you to yet another entrepreneur. This person has helped come up with a new way to make the old heating pad. This is something I need. And here to talk about this new invention is Mr. Bill Lewis. He and his son have come up with this new invention that Mary Beth has in her hands. Check this out. Okay, Bill Lewis, what in the world kind of heating pad is this? Okay. How Short does it work? story. Yeah. About five years ago, I had a very, very sore shoulder. Mm -hmm. The doctor said, we're going to have to do an investigative surgery. And I said, no, 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 no. So he said, all right, get a heating pad. Get an electric heating bed, right? So I got one, and they're all flat. Mm -hmm. <laughs> so trying so to got, make it fit the shoulder. just doesn't work. No, it doesn't. So I got duct tape, and my son was watching me wrestle, and he said, Dad. <laughs> anyway, he redid an old flat one, rewired it, and he came up with the shape, and after about three years and ten prototypes, so he finally came up with something that was a winner. And wow. this is it. There's a strap that goes Here, around here's the, you. Here's the strap. So you just Velcro it. You Velcro it on. And it's adjustable, and it's right? It's adjustable, right? Very big cool. Fat guys like me. All right. <laughs> and, um, and skinny girls like you. Oh, uh -huh. aren't you sweet? Okay. And medium sized guys. Okay. All right. <laughs> that's I'm kind of wonderful. nervous being on TV and no, everything. Take your time can here. I stand up? Can, right I, can I help? No, that's okay. Oh, because you, you can, can do, do it by this, yourself. But whereas you had trouble with the duct tape one. Oh, right? listen. I ran out of duct tape. Okay. Now, this would work on knees as well. We were, we were standing in the kitchen, my daughter, my son, and everybody. And my daughter said, hey, Dad, let me see it. So she took it and said, look at this. And she took it mm -hmm. and put it on her elbow then put it around her neck and oh. said, like this. Like wow. it. Okay. What, this invention thing seems to run in the family. Babe. And then my son said, wait, Dad. And he took uh. it, did like this, see? That's so you're sitting watching TV and just wrap that around. And you don't have to sit there like that. And you know? so, your shoulder, how did it, how did it come okay. out? The good thing about it, okay, the flat heating pad, the heat escapes from under it, no right. matter how much duct tape you are. Right. This captures the heat so you can apply more heat for a longer period of time so you get more heat to the area. And my shoulder got okay in about a week. I mean, it really so did. It really did. Wow. It's called, I think it's called vasodilation. Mm -hmm. It brings more blood to the area. Sure, right. to heal blood's it. what heals the problems so that, of that really seems to give uh, everything more stability it, it, it's not all over the place it stays on one particular area doesn't and you're it? not constantly shifting right. that sore area to try to keep it on yeah and this is the first time in 80 years since the heating pet electric heating pet was invented that a different design has come out so we're the first wow now and you have Walgreens sold out of it so. yeah Walgreens the local Walgreens <laughs> where which one out on Poplar out on Poplar. They sold out. It's, and then we deliver a new order. This was a test market, see? Mm -hmm. and then they sold out of that, so they're taking names and numbers of people that want more, and Walgreens Corporate has called us up to buy them for all the corp all the stores all over the place. Wonderful. So, it, so you're national well, yeah. now? And what's it officially called? Apparently. Joint Inc., and that's our website, jointheat.com. Okay. And it's not tremendously expensive either. It's about the cost of a regular heating pack. It's 40 bucks. It out myself. Yeah, well, we may go not. up. No, I'm kidding. <laughs> <laughs> As you start making that more money? No. It, it won't need to now that you're national. <laughs> that you know, you'll have a lot more 40 bucks. That yeah. is so smart. Talk about necessity being the mother of invention. Yeah. It's there. All right. Smart.
smart to kid. Us. Oh, we appreciate Thank it. So Thank much. you so much. Jointheat.com, you can find out more information about it and how to get it and maybe buy it online if Walgreens doesn't get it in fast. I might need it tomorrow morning around this time after the walk. After walking, yeah. yeah. So. It's yours. <laughs> Thank you. I'm going to need it. Well, yeah. when I get the pedometer back. <laughs> I don't think so. Still to come for you this morning, Much a finger-licking good time is had by a number of people at the Mid-South Fair during a chicken-eating contest. We'll show you how it all unfolded a little later. And when we come back, the Eric Hughes Band takes the stage once again right here in Peabody Place, so stay right there. Oh, this feels better. Now? feels better already. <laughs> I needed this bad. Said it's you have.